Hey guys, what's going on? Ordinary Dad Aaron here with you for your question of the day. So my question for you guys for today is, does your child use a nightlight or have a sound machine? So my son actually has both. The sound machine is just the little thing. It's also an alarm clock too. And when he uses it, it actually, he likes to keep it on the campfire noise, which I love. That's, that's one of the best sounds ever to me personally. But then if you change it at all, he's just not a fan. So obviously like during like heavier thunderstorms or something like that, like we'll try to maybe put it a little bit louder, but he also has the AC on because it's during the summer. So he's got a, a little bit of noise going all around. Now the light. So he has this little light that shoots like a projection up on, up on the wall or on the ceiling. And it does like stars, it has a moon and stuff up there. But it also has like this, uh, glowing look that goes to it and it changes colors so he likes to keep his bedroom door open at night so he just i don't know why he just he, he doesn't want it close he used to like it now he doesn't so we always kind of keep our our bedroom door just slightly open so that way if he calls us or anything like that like we can hear him well this thing is projected at such a way that in our bedroom it's like the aurora borealis is going across our ceiling so i have to make sure that, that our door is at least shut so far otherwise like it actually bugs me it's gotten to a point where now like i prefer more of a darkness to sleep like i'm okay with a that dim light type feel but that that that's too much for me so comment down below let me know if your kids use any of those things and does it affect you in any kind of way like i said it's not the end of the world but like i said i, I i'm good with the aurora borealis in my room so Hope you guys have more than an ordinary day. Take care. I'll see you tomorrow.